Video tonight of an animal hoarding case apparently so bad it took hazmat suits to make the rescue. At least 30 dogs and cats hauled out of a North Phoenix home, but ABC 15's Joe Bartels is now with the Arizona Humane Society and those animals. Joe? Katie, we're told some of those animals are in really bad shape tonight. They were taken here to the Second Chance Animal Trauma Hospital after being pulled from absolutely heartbreaking conditions. Behind the windows and walls of this home near 7th Street and the 101 hid a dirty secret. Animal filth in the backyard, only a hint of the horrors inside. Just the odor, you know, was pretty bad coming. And now, especially with the weather getting warmer, it was just getting worse and worse and worse. Barbara Spade looked on as a Phoenix police and the Arizona Humane Society went in armed with a search warrant. When our team pulled up to the scene, um, they actually could smell the ammonia and feces smell from the street, if that kind of puts things into perspective. 34 dogs and cats ranging from puppies to seniors living in their own filth. The fire department wanted us to put on hazmat suits before our team could go in there because um, the ammonia levels were so high. We went to the home to get answers, but no one came to the door. Online records show Wiggle Butts Animal Rescue is registered at the address. Authorities say the organization had been under investigation for months. You feel bad as a pet owner. You love your animals. And like I said, I'm sure she thought she was doing the right thing by the animals because she wanted to help. As of tonight, we have not heard back from anyone with Wiggle Butts. Phoenix police say criminal charges could be coming soon. Reporting in Sunny Slope, Joe Bartels, ABC 15 Arizona.